underwater. We are heading over to Ferry Terminal and heading over to Maclay Island for another doctor visit. And here we go, the end of the Ferry Terminal. Obviously a lot of uh, repair works, maintenance works down here too. We're going to be seeing that a lot. All the oysters are here at the boat ramp. Miller Islanders, it's our next day here at Russell Island. And we are going through some stuff right now. And yeah, pretty insane. Whenever you're ready, we can move on. The oysters are exposed up there uh, because they're not underwater at the moment. And look at that. Even rain has been falling down here lately. Which isn't surprising really, honestly. Good to obviously see what's happening around Russell Island, but I got a bit of a bit of a bit of negativity at the moment. I just got to quickly put this in just for a quick moment here. Yeah, that way. But gone down to the IGA this morning and the service station. They were out of 600 mil Coca-Cola bottles. Are you serious? This is. The Coca Cola is becoming way too popular on the islands. Are you kidding me? Why? It's just not good at all, islanders. Uh, they, won't, they won't be out of. They, 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 they'll be replenishing it real soon. I hope so. Yeah, Bay Ward. Alright, now that that's out the way, let's just continue on with our episode here. We're going to go down Bayswater Road, which is pretty ironic because we don't, because it's nowhere near the water at all. <laughs> A pirate flag. <laughs> How cool is that to see a pirate flag? So yeah, so we're just heading down this street here, just taking care of the uh, the last streets. I think we remember that rounded roof design right there. We don't get a lot of those around here. It's pretty rare to find those. Because you see a lot of slant roof designs around here as of lately. And of course, roofs that look like that, gable roofs. Yeah, keep going down here, because that, that leads to the same road that we did before. So yeah, so we're just looking down here right now. Of course, lots of vacant land still. But this is the, but this is South Russell Island as well at the same time. Pretty good seeing a lot of lovely, great, lovely houses around here. Mm -hmm. If that makes sense. leads to nowhere over there. So let's just go down here. Nice bush area here. Yeah, there's a lot of things going on around here, isn't there? So what I'm going to probably try to do tonight is um, probably edit some more Island Life episodes so you want to just get your daily dose. Even though I upload them in batches. There's a pond in front of us. Look at that, we've got a real life pond in front of us. Um. Okay, are we going to risk it or not? Oh, yeah. Well, what do you reckon? Do you think we're going to do it or not? I would no. rather go around, to be honest. I'd rather go back and go different yeah. because I can't see how deep it is and what's in there. <laughs> Goodness knows what's in that pond. There could be broken glass or something theoretically and mess it <laughs> Yeah. Up. And yeah, we know we know we know how how silly our island uh, how our people on the islands are. Not you islanders, as I know you islanders are sensible. 
but there's but there's obviously people on the islands here who obviously don't care. Someone parked their own car there. Like for example, yeah. the car that's parked there. For quite a while. Hmm. Still got the number plate on it too. <laughs> there are some people who commit crimes and get away with it. Not the right mindset for living on this island. Not the right mindset. But people don't care. They don't care anyway. Ah, Curlew. I know, you're there, ah, Curlew. There's no hiding it. There's no hiding it, I know, there they are. So, yeah, so we're, still, we're still scrolling through the streets here. I think we just went past that area there that goes down to that pond. I wonder if the pond and the other street are connected as well. Yeah, over there are some more streets as well, so if you can go this Oh yeah, we can, we can actually um, scoot over to those areas too. Yeah, let's go here with a pirate flag as well. Yeah, <laughs> pirate flag, yeah. Alright Islanders, so now we're here along another street here. Okay, well, I don't think we've been down here yet. Down? Boeing Ridge Road, so we'll go down here and we'll find out what's going on down here. Oh, got, look at that. We actually have what looks like a Netherlands flag and an Australia flag at the same time. We'll take a look at that. Deja vu. Mm -hmm. They've got a Netherlands flag and an Australia flag. It kind of looks like a Netherlands flag because the Netherlands flag is red, white, and blue. Horizontal color stripes. Because it's not a France flag. France flag has has those three colors vertically. I see it, yeah. They obviously blatantly copied what was it, Wahini Drive? Oh, actually, no, not not, not a Wahini Drive. Actually, Sea Ward Drive. But you can actually see the colourful house over it, over it, uh, Wahini Drive. Which, by the way, someone that's living over there is going to be leaving now, very very soon. In fact, I think he'll be leaving there as soon as humanly possible. Mm -hmm. Do we know that person? Yes, there? we met her at the IGA and I'm recording, so please oh. do not mention her name. Okay. Go straight on? Yeah, straight on, because uh, we've already explored, I've already explored down there. Yeah. This area looks kind of familiar to me. It does, doesn't it? Yeah. Oh, that's because we're already at the other end of... We're at the other end of Barcelona Terrace, okay. Okay, so we go straight on, look what's there. Yeah. Might as well. Oops. A bit more exploring. More blocks for sale here. Oh yeah, there's more blocks for sale, of course. Of course there is. <laughs> Ooh, my kid, of course there is. And even some of the streets still have the Redland Shire Council signage as well. Alright Islanders, see you later. Alright Islanders, so now we're going down with it. Actually it's Sandy Beach right now, but there's a tent right down there. There you go. And we'll keep going now. That toilet block is obviously an absolute health hazard for many people. Because, because that restroom is, is nastier than 
than any other public restroom that I've ever that I've ever been to in my life. Yes, yeah, so that toilet block right there is obviously it's obviously much yuckier than, than than any other public bathroom I've ever seen in my whole life. It's very unpleasant in that one. Sorry that I had to put that in there, but I had to. Rayworks also there. But as we go past them, thanks for watching this episode of Russell Island Adventures and Island Life. Leave a like and subscribe, and I shall see you Islanders tomorrow. Bye!